Hello loves and welcome to my channel. It's just me and Teddy here <laughs> coming to say hi. Teddy has life so good. He just hangs out, lay across the bed, he all up on my pillows. Like seriously, this this beer just has the best life. He just chills, watch me doing all my work every day and don't ever try to, to help. He don't pay rent. He just has, just happy. Happy dude. I really want to grow up to be like Teddy. <laughs> I don't know how many of you are feeling like me, but I am so not ready for fall. I am definitely not ready for winter. Yeah, but we have no choice but to prepare for it. So I did a little bit of shopping, not a lot, in H&M. H&M have some beautiful, beautiful pieces. And I decided just to grab a few. I didn't do a lot of shopping at all in the summer because I really didn't do a lot of different activities. So I figured why spend money on you know, clothing that I wasn't going to wear. I'm actually picking up items now because um, I did another haul recently and I picked up a few things that will be good for a vacation in a warm and sunny climate. So hopefully I'll get to do that sometime soon. Um, yeah, so the world is opening back up. Uh, COVID is still here, but you know, people are still trying to live a normal or as normal a life as possible. And I, you know, I need to at least get to see my family in Barbados. Um, I haven't seen them since COVID, so I, I do miss them. And I miss the beach and I miss my friends there and whatnot. So <laughs> yeah, hopefully I'll get to visit there sometime really, really soon. Hey fam, hey friends, if any of you are watching, just know that I am planning <laughs> my getaway. Um, or my grand escape <laughs> that's what I'm calling it now all right so enough of my rambling if you're new here thank you so much for joining me um, so my channel is basically geared towards fashion lifestyle um, fitness and some travel um, I've had this channel for a very long time this YouTube channel I hadn't been using it for almost two years and I recently just dusted off my vlog camera and decided, hey, let's get back into it. Um, I, so I hope that you will join me along for the ride. So please don't forget to subscribe and of course, give me a thumbs up um, uh, and stick with me. <laughs> Looking forward to see you guys in my coming videos. First item that I'm going to be showing you is this white dress. Now this dress is so beautiful. I could not resist it. Now it buttons up at the neck or you can open it up. You will realize that so many things are more conservative this year. This year has become a year where being more covered up has been a trend. Um, wearing things that were more dramatic like we had all the dramatic frills and flounces and um, collars and whatnot and puffy puffy sleeves which I absolutely adore um, this one has some fairly big sleeves as well this dress has this wide cape like um, frill this cape like frill around the neck and this eyelet material which I absolutely love at the edge as well as the, the, the hem. You can button it all the way up or leave a few buttons open. Um, you know, it's all about how you choose to style this. And I actually plan to style this dress not just by itself but I want to incorporate maybe a jeans or something like that with it. I think that would be a good, a good look. Also, um, for this look, I chose to pair it with these Sam Edelman um, leopard print booties that I've had for probably about two years. I decided to pair the dress with this black biker jacket. It's, it's from Faux Leather. I've had it for a few years now. I purchased it from Zara's. It was a really good buy. 
Um, I love the fit of it. I feel like it's a jacket that I will have uh, for a very long time um, because of the classic style of that biker jacket look. It's something that I can keep in my wardrobe for a very long time. I know for leather eventually starts to um, come apart, but I've tried to take very good care of this one and hope to get some more years of wearing out of it. I wear a size small or sometimes extra small. The white dress is actually um, size small and I think that because it's made very voluminously that I could have gotten away with an extra small but I'm happy with uh, the way the small fits but just for reference I am 5'8 I'm 145 pounds and my waist is like 27 my hips is 41 and my bust is 36 so just for reference you get a, a sense of what my size is versus yours so you can have a sense of what size would work best for you now all of these items were purchased online and I tried them on after I got them each item has fit me almost perfectly and next up is this mom jeans now, in this jeans I picked up a size 4 size 4 is usually my size size 4 US and it fit me perfectly and for the price of this I I was like wow this this um, fits perfectly exactly how I wanted it to fit it's high-waisted um, it's just enough room in the legs not too voluminous not too wide and it, it comes out into a tapered crop hem which I love I like the way the, the placement of where the hem hits me since it comes up a little higher um, above the ankle so that you can you know wear your booties or whatever and not have to fold them up for you to see the booties I love that it um, it accentuates my my butt um, I I really love this jeans I would love it if they have it in another color I actually need to check and see maybe they have it in black would we'll definitely purchase it also in black um, so I decided to pair this jeans with this floral top you will notice that florals has been transitioning not just for spring and summer but into the winter and fall seasons because of the type of florals that prints that you will see such as this one now having a floral print with the darker colors in it with a little pop of lighter colors like pink orange and yellow um, makes them perfect for the fall and the, the winter because of the dark background it just winterizes the actual outfit um, dress whether it's a top a dress or a skirt it just makes it more winter by having that darker background I love that it has this um, elastic throughout the front area which allows it to shape a mold to your body um, it's a very flattering top I love again the poofy sleeves and I also like the fact that I can wear it both front and back. Now, this button was giving me hell to actually close, um, especially from the back. I turned it around and decided, let me try it from the front. And I decided to wear it both front and back just to give you an idea of what it looked like. I just like the fact that it has like a little bit of your skin peeking through when you wear it from um, in the back, from back to front, sorry. Um, yeah love this top um, I plan to get a lot of wearing out of it you can wear it tucked in or you can choose to wear it outside um, of your skirt or pants whatever you choose to wear with it in this floral top I picked up the medium and it fits perfectly love exactly how it fits and finally this beautiful faux leather poofy sleeve shirt now this top is very light and and it doesn't I mean even though it's faux leather you can wear it right now or and I can see you're possibly wearing it on one of the cooler days of the summer um, because of the styling of it so it's made with the ability to wear it off the shoulder or on the shoulder and again there is that elastic um, that runs right throughout the front and the back 
back in um, as I grew, when I was growing up, we used to call this look um, smocking. If you're if you're from the Caribbean or you're from Barbados, you would probably know what I'm talking about. But we we would always call this the smocking look or the smocking material. I love that detail about the this. I love that you can actually see it very clearly. Um, almost like if it's ruched up or something, you can clearly see that detail in the black leather. Now you can't see it so much in the floral um, shirt, but you can totally see it in this, and I love that part about it. And this top, I picked up a size medium, but I could have gone with a size small and maybe even an extra small. So I'm thinking I may exchange it because the the top part of the the um, the sleeves seem to be falling off of my shoulder too easily rather than staying so I think I may need to go down with size but um, sometimes I'll pick up a medium top because I want the sleeves to actually fit me a lot bigger um, but in this case I would have preferred it if the top was a little bit smaller if you wore this with a very high-waisted skirt or our pants um, I think that it could be tucked in as well so that you can have the choice to wear it where you're showing some where you're showing some waistline or you can be more covered up by wearing something with a higher waist and i decided to go with all leather and this faux leather pants was also from h&m and this was last season's i killed this pants last year I mean I killed it literally but still is standing it's in very very good condition I wore this pants so many times last season and I find that depending on what I wear it with it almost looks like a different pants that I'm wearing love 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 this faux leather um, pants um, I like the fact that it's a crop style and I can almost wear it with anything I can dress up or dress it down by wearing it with a pair of sneakers or you know dressing it up by adding a pair of heels and a really nice sexy top just like this leather um, shirt and for warmth I would probably throw on that same um, biker jacket and just go with the all over black that monochromatic look which I also love alright guys so that is it that was my very small uh, H&M um, haul um, I hope that you enjoyed it let me know which of the items you like the most um, and if you are interested I will be leaving links to every item that I purchased as long as it's still available I will be leaving links to them in the description also be in mind that these links that I'll be leaving are affiliate links so if you do purchase something I will get a very small commission from from your purchase so if you do thank you I appreciate you don't forget again to subscribe if you haven't already and give this video a thumbs up thank you for sticking with it and seeing it through to the end I look forward to seeing you in my next video take care now bye